Hello, this is Nick with Albert Air, and today we are looking at a three ton carrier infinity variable speed condenser with green speed technology. I'm going to go through this uh, installation that we did. I'm going to discuss the features, the benefits of this system, and I'm also going to let you know about all the rebates this system got because this is one of the best systems on the market today, and Carrier makes it. It's the top of the line infinity series. It gets a lot of rebates, so stay tuned for that. And as always, please like this video and subscribe to my channel for more content about carrier systems. If you have any questions, make sure you leave those in the comments section below and I will answer those for you. And if you're in the Orange County, California area, you can get a hold of me at 714-526-6368 or visit us at albertair.com. So this is the three ton carrier infinity variable speed condenser. The model number on this is 24VNA6. 36A003. Um, this is going to be one of the best systems that you can buy in terms of the efficiency of the system, uh, how comfortable this will make your house with all of its speeds, and how quiet it is. It is on right now. It's very quiet, and I'm able to talk and do this video. So its efficiency in the three ton size is 22 plus SEER 2, and that efficiency is based on the matchup of the outdoor condenser here and we match that indoors with the carrier infinity variable speed furnace it's a 95 percent furnace um, and then we also have the carrier infinity control thermostat um, so when you match it with those as well as the evaporator coil um, you'll get an ahri certificate that will tell you the exact efficiency and that is 22 or sorry 22 plus sear 2. Um, this condenser is a variable speed and has 75 speeds in it. So from 25% capacity up to 75% capacity in 1% increments. So what that does is it dials in the speeds it's gonna run at based on your outdoor temperature sensor, which is on the unit. And then it also talks with the thermostat inside that senses the temperature in there, as well as humidity. So this will pull out more humidity. It has dehumidification functions. Uh, as well as the, all those different speeds. So depending on the time of day, how hot it is, it will run at different speeds to keep you comfortable all the time, a lot more even throughout the day in the house with, with very, very little temperature spikes. Um, the sound rating on this, um, right now we're running at a lower speed. I think we're probably around 35 to 40% because the house is almost satisfied in terms of its cooling in there. Um, and you can hear it, it's very quiet. Uh, the low speed on this will be as low as 53 decibels. The high speed, only 62 decibels. So very low on both, but you can see the fan is kind of barely running right now. We are on a very, very low speed. It's just maintaining temperature inside. So if, if this is in your backyard, side yard, by maybe a bedroom window, this you won't even know it's on. You'd have to literally walk around the corner to see the fan moving a lot of time to see if it's on um, these uh condensers uh for the infinity series um they are all going to be 35 with 35 depth by 47 inches high so that's in all sizes two ton three ton four ton and five ton so this is the three ton um and it's gonna be in the same cabinet as all of the 24 vna sixes um, on this condenser another interesting thing is that the max circuit amps are 20 amps on this. And this is a three ton condenser. So in the breaker panel, we have a, a, you know, a 220 two pole breaker that is 20 amp. We have 20 amp fuses in the disconnect right there. Um, and so this pulls a very, very low amp draw uh, for runtime amps. Uh, most three ton condensers are around 30 amps, sometimes a little higher. So, so you can see like when you're running electrical to these, you shouldn't have an issue with existing wiring. Um, you can run a number 10 wire up to about 50 feet off the panel and do that 20 amp uh, fuses in the disconnect with the 20 amp breaker. And finally, I'm gonna talk about the rebates with this system. We got a ton of rebates because this is one of the best systems on the market. We're also in the city of Anaheim, which has really good rebates. And then they did a gas furnace uh, that's 95% that also got rebates. So. 
The first rebate, the biggest one, is going to be the Carrier Cool Cash Instant Rebate. That is $1,700 from Carrier. It is uh, based on the matchup of this outdoor condenser with the indoor furnace and the infinity control thermostat it is an instant rebate uh, carrier runs that a few times a year they have a spring rebate program and a fall rebate program um, the next rebate that we got was from anaheim advantage services that was for six hundred dollars that is based on the tonnage of the actual equipment so this is a three ton you get two hundred dollars per ton and you have to have an efficiency over 15 sear and 12 eer which this easily did it was 22 plus sear two uh and i believe the eer on this is like 13.5 so easily got that rebate the other rebate it qualifies for would be the uh the tax credit which comes at the end of the year so that's not an instant rebate but uh you just have to be 16 sear and 12 eer to qualify for the air conditioning federal tax credit um you just need an ahri certificate and a paid invoice to get that and show your tax guy at the end of the year and then because we did uh match the system with a 95 percent furnace that qualified for a socal gas company rebate of 276 dollars so all in all, with all those rebates added up, they got over $3,000 in rebates on this system. They got a fantastic system. Uh, they're ready for the summer. Right now we're just entering into July. So um, it's really hot here in Southern California. It's been about 90 to 94 degrees every day. Um, this house is cooling with no issues. Uh, when there is high humidity, the dehumidification function comes on and helps with that. Uh, the customer is extremely happy. They love how quiet it is, how comfortable and how their energy bill has gone down dramatically. And we just finished all the rebate paperwork because uh, the permits are now final on this. So they'll be getting all those rebates back from the city and the gas company. So let me know what you think of this system. Um, leave a comment in the section below. Make sure you like and subscribe to this uh, channel. We appreciate you watching. Thank you very much.